It's time to hit the third, which is where you guys are, have been flourishing now <laughs> for a while, which is living in the digital era. Yeah. What are the, what are the first thoughts? Now when you look back, <laughs> two years, did well, career change, how does it look? How does it feel? I mean, my life feels like the happy montage in a movie right now. <laughs> but then I'm always looking at my life like it's digital, right? When I'm sad, I'm like, oh, if we combine all the sad moments of my life, that's a sad <laughs> montage. But do I choose to think of it as a happy montage or a sad montage? So, I don't think that makes sense to anybody. But like, in my head, that's how my life is just like a movie, basically. Yeah, yeah, no, that because I'm like, I could literally make a highlight reel on my life today if I just take yeah. the uh, videos from, from my phone. But um, I think m I have kind of decided not to like see social media as work mm. and as any job you would sign out at some point. So I have decided that okay, my work hours might be weird, but I can sign off at any time, mm. and uh, that's something that has helped me personally a lot with like living in the digital era. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so what you do? You have college. You have, I'm sure, questions that are posed at you and you have for yourself is what yeah. next do I do after this? It may not be the traditional, conventional mm. career paths mm. that you have taken. Mm. So if this is what you're going forward with, yeah. Yeah. have you been able to convince your parents? Yeah, yeah. Uh, to be honest. Yeah, that was uh, <laughs> an, an interesting conversation, 100%. But I think what happened was, I, from the start, like, you know, mm. we had the conversation before the camera started rolling. I've wanted to do this, right, since uh -huh. I was a child. And it was never a possibility or a reality. And even in the lockdown, it just happened for me. Right? Mm. I've been doing this for seven years. And then just in the lockdown, it just happened to click for me. And I knew that if I go to my parents, like, Mom, Dad, I'm not doing a video. Bana na. They would be like, Bro, shut up. Like, just shut up. But I think, I think what helped uh, my parents in kind of getting convinced that, okay, because they can do this is the fact that I showed them that I was responsible, mm. I was accountable and I treated this like a job. When they saw uh, the numbers coming in, when they, especially it's important, when they saw the money coming in. Right. Like, wow, we didn't yeah. even make money. Money, money so on this. You can live your yeah, life. well, you know. It's like a thappa, like, 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 like yeah, 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 yeah. a validation. Yeah. Exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah. It is, it is. And um, <laughs> that conversation with my parents was, Good for me because touch wood, my parents are really understanding and they, they still to this day they always support me and it was definitely interesting because um, initially before any of this happened uh, my mom's friend or somebody you know or, like they used to say oh this is for example you know, this is a big thing about sending a child abroad to study. Yes. Yes. So, oh, Agassi is in India. Oh, okay, okay. And <laughs> How like, unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's not in some exactly. below average college. Yeah, not in <laughs> <laughs> and now it's the same, like, kind of mothers or, like, you know, parents or coming and oh, my younger son, watches Agassi, congratulations. And nice. It's so, like, now is the time that my mom is like, okay, fine. He's doing something. He's doing So, yeah, it's, it's not bad. It's good. <laughs> Good. Validation is important, isn't it? Yeah. yeah? This, is, this is a joke that I haven't shared. So. <laughs> go for it, go what for is it. it. Isn't it funny how bitches turn into your fans? Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about validation. It's oh. all about when somebody signs you up for something, yep. you win that award, mm -hmm. you know, yep. that eluding yep. award that comes your way, mm -hmm. and then you have that to show to people. Validation always works, and mm -hmm. I think validation uh, is, is good that it works because it kind yeah. of helps you also and pushes you forward. So, do you like these validations coming your I way? And you still have to face people who turn around and say, What the hell are you doing with your life? I hate external validation. Totally I agree. hate that my parents think today I'm making money, so I was so, putting yeah. in. I'm putting mm. in more effort. I was putting in as much effort when I was broke. I was making 20 videos a day. I uh, I hate that like now. I had uh, school friends, college friends going like, oh, this sucks. She was going to be a joker professionally, blah, blah, blah. And now suddenly they're like, hey, this building friend of mine has a daughter <laughs> and she has a birthday wish from you. And I'm like, okay, where was this? Like, even if I think somebody is like, I, I don't think that validation should come from outside. I think the amount of effort you're putting in, mm. it should be enough to earn you that validation. True. Like I hate that it's money and like, yeah. it, I know that 
and i know that everyone is going to say that oh easy for her to say privilege blah 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 i i don't share my finances with the world like it was <laughs> it's always important for your parents for like to your parents that you make money but i hate that it's important like yeah. i mean you there, there are other things right like right. the amount of time effort mm. like skills you're learning and all of that right. and that you're enjoying your life like right. i could be doing an engineering jo- i could not but <laughs> let's say hypothetically somebody could be doing an engineering job making bank but then you yeah i couldn't yeah, make it bad, but not happy not happy in their life like and then people are always like oh but why isn't he happy because i feel like external validation has never led to happiness it's all like agastya could have been making the same money doing like some oil rig work or something yeah, right yeah, like would he be happy yeah, like no correct. so it's sad that we have to kind of you know in the time that we need people the most mm. that time they're like kya kar rahe like useless loser you, yeah. like but suddenly when you're doing the same thing a little bit money comes and oh, everyone's like exactly happy. it's like you know operational you are yeah i'm like it's like the support is not there when it's needed, needed. it's there yeah. when it's not needed. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah you know when somebody when starting out or like yeah. you know when somebody starting out and even if you see that okay for example like if if a creator has a thousand followers okay and if i genuinely like the content i just go ahead and send them a voice note saying hey i really like your content keep making this because you never know when you can catch them on that one off day mm, when right. they are feeling like giving up or what if they are the next big thing and what if your one voice note can actually motivate them that okay I, i'm getting that kind of support from somebody i don't even know then why not just keep doing so it's just supporting people when they need support not when they made it or like don't need support you know it's a very important uh, point that sakshi has raised with his uh, which with which i would like to actually close the session but you were saying i was just saying people did that with us i think yeah really exactly exactly out. yeah there were lots of big people who were just like very openly being like hey you're doing good please exactly. do it that really there's no need they yeah. were just nice to us and guys which is the one thing that makes validation so in the face today it is one of the portals which has given us our platforms and something we call the blue tick hands up for the blue ticks in the room i don't know <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but it is so validating right i mean yeah. it is yeah unfortunately no, it, is. it it is right you unfortunately every social engine our society works on external validation right. and that it. is what we are taught from day one <laughs> but i would kind of like, agree with sakshi uh, that can i tell you this blue tick thing i was quite excited when See, i got the blue exactly. tick exactly and so it I works for my boyfriend and he yes. was like this blue tick thing is not even that important they're just ver- verifying because there are people making fake accounts in your name it's just that it's not the validation guys, yeah and i was like you know that actually makes sense and then since then i'm like yeah who cares about this blue tick yeah. no, i can't don't take it away <laughs> but like i mean when you put it in perspective with what it actually yes. meant Yes. And now I'm just like, yeah. I mean, it'll come. It, it doesn't make a difference. It like, doesn't make a difference. It, it's just say, like yeah. it's fun, you know. Like and Absolutely. whatever. I feel like we're we creating the same content. Yeah, yeah with or without it. Like even awards for that matter. Yeah. Like it's fun to receive them. It's Absolutely. fun to be in a place where there are fifty creators having a good time. But at the same time, like you would, you're creating content for yourself. Exactly. No? exactly. So this external validation. it comes and goes but at the end of it you and your uh, yeah. your self worth needs to be validation enough that you are you you are whole your soul mm. and you're worth it mm. absolutely one world your station Radio 1.